In my view, heat from the earth can warm up America's job creation engine while it cools down the climate. And that, in my view, is an agenda for the times and an agenda for this century. Projects like Neil Hot Springs can in effect be a trampoline, almost a kind of foundation or jumping off point for this particular area of renewable energy and help us get more family wage jobs across the state. By supporting projects like Neil Hot Springs, we can incentivize a new generation of clean energy technologies into the marketplace that create jobs, strengthen the economy, and help the nation compete and lead the global clean energy race. We're delighted uh, to be part of Oregon's uh, renewable energy future and we're especially pleased to join with Dan and US Geothermal as a partner in this uh, very exciting Neil Springs project. At Enbridge we believe our green energy investments are not only good for the environment, they are clearly good for our business, offering attractive returns and providing a new and more diversified source of earnings growth that complements our petroleum, liquids and natural gas transportation businesses. Most uh, economies that you want to develop something in require investor incentives to get there. Uh, they don't stand on their own very well. Renewable energies are, are new, pro new, new ideas. So therefore investors need to get over certain risks and, and, and hurdles. This was true of oil and gas years and years ago. This was true of the coal industry years ago. And so with the right kind of incentives in place, then investors are given additional reasons to, to grow a sector, to invest in a sector. But more importantly now than ever, we need these incentives to be longer term. We can't be renewing tax credits every year for the renewable sector. We've got to ask Congress to grant a longer term stable tax credit regime that investors can rely on for years to come. The whole idea of taking you know, the heat from the earth and producing electricity makes absolute sense. It's there, it's constant, um, it isn't a source that is intermittent. Um, sun, wind, not to knock them, but they're intermittent supplies of, of energy. The thermal energy is always there. Not only could we get a, a foothold in the renewable energy business, but we could do it on a very economic basis. I mean, these projects are environmentally sensible, but they're also good business investments for Enbridge. The Neil Hot Springs uh, geothermal project will be uh, our largest project to date and is going to enable our company to do many great things. Uh, we'll be able to hire new people, incorporate new businesses uh, to help us buy new equipment and uh, employ a lot of people. And We're very grateful to have this opportunity to work with uh, U.S. Geothermal on this project. The State of Oregon has also had, always had a future forward look on renewable energy. We have seen progress in wind and solar and we've been waiting a long time for geothermal to join in and provide diversity that will help both our economy and the environment. This U.S. geothermal project at Neil Hot Springs is, is that project and we're hoping that it's a catalyst for many more to come.